Could you just feel like you ran your offense well? You just had some good looks, just didn't fall? Yeah, I think that's, that's uh, I think that's what we do well. So I think the next game shots won't fall, and then you know, we're going to play for uh, next Sunday. So I'm going to always go uh, practice. I think uh, we're going to be ready for next game shots won't fall. With 72 and 77 points came in these five starters, do you guys expect scoring from these guys like TJ or Jake Warren? Yeah, I just see them going on. I mean, uh, Pets going to be a little more comfortable out there. He's probably going to play more than he did today. And we're going to be able to play against other teams. So, you know, Jake, Jake, Jake was out there a little bit. He missed some shots that he usually makes. Jake's a scorer, though, so that's, he's out there being a rookie scorer. So, TJ, TJ is playing with TJ today. He played hard. He, he had some open shots today. He, he made some for me today. So, I mean, I just see him going on. Man. Different guys are going to step up today. Summer, took the summer off and worked out. So I think it's starting to benefit. I'm starting to, I'm starting to show you can see uh, he, he works hard. He really, he really works hard. He takes pride in what he does. He loves to be out there. And I think, uh, I think he's coming along well. Tell us your thoughts on, uh, you know, four guys in double figures. And, you know, actually getting 13, you yourself getting 12 rebounds. Talk about the difference between, you know, with the double double compared as to a 31 point performance. Uh, do you feel like uh, these were two very positive uh, games? Scooty, for you and Cully, feel free to jump in as well. Do you feel like for the two of you, this was a very positive uh, second game? Uh, on the first game, for me personally, I think it was, uh, had a lot of shots I didn't knock it down. He kept telling me to keep shooting. So for me, I think it was just a lesson I needed. What's it like, and maybe Khalid for you, what's it like for you guys to start as one? Fran put like that whole second wave of guys in there with Jake, and he, he looks like he's serious about using that depth. Um, are you guys still kind of figuring out that mix of it, it, getting that rest? It probably doesn't, it probably feels abnormal for you guys to get, to get a little bit of rest like that. For me personally, I mean, uh, I mean, Dalton's he just you know, a little rusty or a little bit, a little bit of a funk right now? I mean, uh, Dalton's going, he's going to be good. He's going to, uh, I mean, right now he's trying to fill his leg with what he needs to do. You know, he's not sure if he's open to shoot it. He just, I mean, as the season goes on, the season goes on, he practices more with us. We keep practicing, we keep getting more confidence. Coach gets more confidence in him. He's going to get comfortable. He's going to, he's going to help us out a lot. Scooty, can you talk about uh, what you guys got from earlier? I mean, he doesn't usually lead the team in scoring. Uh, has you just seen more him getting more and more aggressive on that end of the court? Yeah, I think uh, I think Larry has a lot to. I think he can contribute a lot as we go along. So I think that uh, tonight was a big night for him. It was a big, uh, big confidence he got in him. So I think uh, he's going out here to be a good yeah, defensive ball, score the ball well. So I think that he will continue to do so. When you guys are, are struggling from the three point line like you did tonight, do you say to him like, hey, you know? Score on the basket. We need you to step up tonight. I mean, Valera gonna be Valera, so you know we just find ways to get him some shots and make him feel confident and have confidence in what we do. So, Scooby, can you 
we have done a lot of mid range shots for us today, so that's what's going to you know, open things up for us as scorers. So I think that, uh, I think that you know, making sure everybody has confidence in each other is key for us. What do you feel like you need to do to get set for Delaware? Again, this was certainly an up and forth type battle. Uh, first game, good win, of course. I'm told up and forth for the second one. What are your thoughts on for the Blue Hats?